Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for whenever it resonates. We're just going to see what comes up. Remember, the timing is fluid, and this reading is not sign specific. What do we got for an energy? What kind of message do I need to deliver today? What kind of message? What do we got? Dear God, angels, spirits, and universe. What do we have? Timing is fluid, but this is what's coming in. Whew. Wow. It's bright, whatever it is. Whatever is coming in is is uh, probably something that you asked for. I mean, this is a... This is a hopes and wishes being fulfilled. So somebody's wishes are about to be fulfilled. This is this is a gift from a some sort of gift, okay? A gift from heaven or uh, another place, okay? So, so there is some sort of It's like there's a some there's a prayer being answered of some sort, a wish being granted. Okay, so there's a wish being granted. I mean, that's what that is. It's hard with that damn light. <laughs> ah, there we go. So anyway, yeah, there's a wish being granted. We'll leave that right there. Mm, well, I guess we're going to take these, huh? It's a little pile, but I think I can probably use them. Right? Um, I think we will. Woo! Well, we have a completion of some sort. A major completion. This is success. So we have a phase that is coming to an end. It's a time. This is also a card of renewal. It's a time of inspiration. It's a time of hope. This is a blessing. So there's an ending that brings about a blessing. This is the end. The very end of a journey. Okay? So we have something that is completing, which is going to... This This is a, a blessing in disguise. It's an ending that brings a blessing. So. Hmm. So what do we got here? What do we got here? You notice I just stuck them all down without even thinking? Alright, so we have a blessing in disguise. That's what it just starts out as. So in disguise, it means it may not feel. There's an ending that may not feel good. Okay, it may not feel good, but it's a blessing in disguise. This is a moment of decision. There is a decision that is going to be made. And it's like, it's, 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 and if you notice, this decision is, is facing away from this situation. So it looks like somebody is going their own way and leaving something behind, for sure. It's like they got the whole world in front of them now, okay? It's like, and it's, it's interesting because this is ending. So there's some, a phase that is ending and it's like now they're stepping into new territory. They're stepping onto new ground, but this there's a feeling of insecurity okay so somebody is is uh definitely not happy this is discontent about this completion so we have an ending here that is happening could be sudden and it may be sudden somebody could suddenly be come single you know or be on their own okay it's like all of a sudden you're on your own and when I say single, maybe you're already single and somebody leaves and it's it's not who you think it is. Oh, just keep that in mind. But this is being at that crossroads and going, going forward because you notice all this is behind. So somebody is truly leaving something behind and it may be out of their control that this is happening because this is a universe card. This is the universally driven. Something is coming to an end, whether you like it or not. 
this is not stable. Something is not stable, okay? Somebody has been in a situation where they weren't seeing something clearly or they were they were ignoring they were ignoring an opportunity or they just were refusing to see something but now we have a decision being made to turn their back somebody is going someplace else I, I mean I know this is the truth here we hear this a lot but this is this this is the decision being made the two of wands this right here is a change. There's a change. And you notice this person is juggling two. So maybe maybe there's two changes. It feels like there's two. Something to do with the number two. This is unstable. We have a definitely somebody that is unstable. They're insecure. There's a loss of uh, growth or there's no growth. There could be a mother. This could be a mother that is... Um, I mean, this is lack of fertility, and this is lack of fertility, or lack of uh, growth. There's the end of a partnership here. Somebody has been holding on. They've been holding on for dear life, and it's getting old. It's, it's gotten to the point where there's no growth there. There's no vitality, okay? There's no passion. There's no desire. There's no uh, spark. This is a very stressful situation. Somebody could be ill. Okay. With this nine of swords. Very, very stressful. Overwhelmed with with thoughts. Maybe even fear, stress. Somebody is, is definitely stressed out over a, a partnership. There's a breakup here or a split. And this could be a, a it's two people going separate directions. Okay, we could, I knew we had something to do with twos. I didn't even see this one. Two, two, two. So we definitely, it's like, there's. it feels like there's two situations here. Two, it could even be two. I hate to say this, but I feel like it's two losses. Okay, I do. I feel like it's two losses. And it's because of somebody's instability. This is instability, instability, insecurity. Um, there's This person is not practical. They're irresponsible. They don't work hard. They're lazy. We have a lazy individual here that is about to experience a split of some sort. Um, it's There's just no growth here. There's a lack of growth. There's a lack of... of, of uh, ability to grow it's like it's going south it's going downhill something is going downhill it's like a it's like a thumbs down kind of energy uh, but this is a blessing there's a blessing so I think there's a decision that is going to be made and this is this is this is definitely a higher power that is is involved here okay because the two of Pentacles is a geometric power is at work here. It's earthly powers are larger. Okay, so we have earthly powers right here. All three of these, th those cards right there are earthly powers that are larger than us in this realm. That is what is in control here. So there's going to be, I think there's going to be some chaos. There's going to be some upheaval because things are about to change. Something is coming to an end and it might not feel comfortable, but there's a blessing in disguise. It is a blessing in disguise. So. We do have a split here. We have a union that is, is some, it's like there's, there's closure. Okay. There's, there's a door that is closing by the looks of things. There's a feeling of, uh, Somebody hasn't been getting attention. They weren't being taken care of. Um, there's a lost opportunity here. This is not getting attention, not being taken care of. Um, now there's going to be a decision made. This is not, this person is not stable. They're not secure. They're not, uh, hard working. They don't put in a lot of effort. Let's clarify this over here. This nine of pentacles reversed. Somebody's turning your, their back on this person and going someplace else. 
taking action to bring success. Somebody is going to be finding the resources or using the resources to bring success, to bring somebody something more emotionally fulfilling. It's like breaking somebody free from a situation that they have been stuck in. Willing to shed the old to bring in the new. So somebody is definitely leaving something old behind and focusing on the future. It's We're done sacrificing. There's been some sort of sacrifice. It's over. It's over. This, this period of overanalyzing, we have a lot of overanalyzing here with these two cards, is over. It's like the decision is made. I'm done thinking about it. It's time. It's time to take action. So there's going to be some action that is taken. And it has to do with love. Somebody may, may have manifested a new opportunity for love. This is love, big love, emotional fulfillment, extreme love. Okay, this is big. And over, uh, what's this word? Uh, uh, I can't even think of the words. Like I can't say it right. It's like a. Uh, it's not over. An abundance, an abundance of love, and here somebody has been really unstable. And in a situation where they weren't getting love. Somebody was in a situation with a person where they were dealing with a person that was selfish. And they weren't getting love. But it's like, this is this is like making a decision that I want love. And, and this is getting, this is your prayers being answered as well. This is, this is, this is, so this is getting love. This is being loved, being loved. It's all about love. So this is love. I mean, this Ace of Cups is love. A new opportunity for love or emotional, or an emotional connection. After being in a state of limbo, after being in a state of lack, it's like coming out of lack, coming out of limbo, right into love. So somebody has manifested big love. I mean, that's what that is. And this is as above, so below. So this is this is like a gift. I'm telling you what, somebody is going to be getting a gift of love. And I, I was trying. I was thinking of when I couldn't say it. It was like overspilling. It's an outpouring. I think I said abundance, but it's an outpouring of love. After being in, stuck in a situation where they weren't getting any attention, stuck, not getting any attention. Somebody wasn't getting attention, but now they're about to. Somebody's about to get some attention. Decision is being made here. What is this two of wands? Somebody has definitely been discontent. Ooh, somebody, this is, somebody has been suffering. Somebody has been suffering in a heartbreaking situation. Heartbreaking. Somebody may, may be making a decision to pull them swords out and start the healing process. Um... This is a necessary separation when you see the Three of Swords. That is a necessary situation, uh, separation. It's necessary. It's painful. And it's a loss. But it's needed. This separation is needed because it's, it's too... Uh, it's too painful. So yeah, there's, there's a necessary separation here. There is. There's a separation that needs to happen. Oh, jeez, I'm crawl. I can't even. I'm telling you what we have a we have a a partnership that is is separating. We have two people, and when I say partnership, we are in partnerships or relationships. We talk about this a lot with our family members, 
our children, our 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 parents, our siblings, our lovers, our best friends, our co-workers, whatever. We have a separation here and it is going to be painful. So we have a painful separation with two people that are not meant to be together anymore. And I'm sorry, but that is the truth. And this could be anybody. There's two people that are not meant to be together and there's going to be a separation. It's just not meant to be. But there is another, there's a blessing in disguise because there is, there's a higher power involved and there's a bigger opportunity for love. And somebody hasn't been seeing it. They haven't been seeing it because they've been focused on something that they were so consumed with that they couldn't see that there was a bigger, better opportunity because of their own inability or refusal to see. They were they were just trying to overanalyze the causes of why and, you know, just too much. Not, not realizing that there was a reason, not re realizing that there was a higher power. There's There's big love here. There's big love, but you have to find that strength to let go of whatever isn't meant to be. And some people just, they never find it. Anyhow, we have some, somebody that is about to experience a heartbreaking split. And it's like, it's time for a change. This is a card of change. This phase is over. This may feel, um, very, uh, uncomfortable but there's a blessing there's a blessing waiting uh so somebody's somebody's wish is about to be fulfilled and maybe it was a a past life thing i don't know but there is a uh a higher power involved that is and this could be the planetary influences whatever it is there is something there's a there's a uh, there's a another power that is beyond this earthly realm, okay? That is causing a shift, okay? And they are, it's like they are taking something away and bringing something better. And that's what I got. Somebody's been holding on to a dead end and it's like you can't hold on to it forever. You've been resisting this change and it's caused too stress kills stress kills it's caused too much illness it's it's time it's time um one more card one more card there's a lack of growth here there's a lack of fertility there's nothing left there's nothing left that can grow here it's time for a change it's time to take that next step when you see two two twos you need to have faith and trust and take that next step you are being urged to take that next step if you're being urged to begin and start a new foundation stop playing games oh god we have somebody here that has been clinging to control very 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 controlling um refusing refusing to take a new approach refusing to this is very unreasonable self-centered conceited uh naive impulsive this person has just been uh unable to see no vision unable to see so we have somebody here that has been unable to see that there's a big opportunity for love. And it's like the universe, and I know that it is something in the universe is saying, okay, you don't want to see it? <laughs> you're going to have, you're going to experience it. If you don't want to see it, that's fine, but you're going to experience it. You're going to experience it whether you like it or not. Destined change of course that is what we got I was holding it like this destiny is playing out it's time for a change this cycle that you have been reluctantly or not reluctantly you've been reluctant to let go of you've been holding on to you've been refusing to let it end you've been refusing to let this cycle end it's ending. Good luck.